Pastor White says that what is it that we need to fear most? It is not that which comes from outside that we need to fear. And I'm paraphrasing. But we need to fear within. The focus on Smyrna is primarily about the persecution that they went through. They claim, profess to be Christians, Jews of the church. But in fact, they were really of the synagogue, the congregation of Satan. They were, the, the, the Bible say, calls them today those who have a form of godliness. They were betrayers of the true followers of Christ. That was the blasphemy that they committed. They betrayed the faithful into the hands of the enemy of those who would persecute them. That's what they did. And we see, and that is why in verse 10 it says, Fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer after. He talked about those who say they are Jews and they are not, and the blasphemy. The Bible then says, Fear none of those things which you shall suffer. And then it says that the devil will cast some of you into prison and so forth to be tried. They were betrayers of the faithful. We read these things. And sometimes it's, it's difficult to fathom when described what they went through, how they lived during this period of persecution. Tunnels under the earth. And they did not murmur. So forth. And we are merely talking about living in the country. And some of us find it very difficult how we're going to live here. And we are fretting and sweating and stressing about country living. But, but if, you, if you understand, we need to take time to read some of these things, which is there as an example for us what they went through what they had to do what they did and they did not murmur they kept their faith what unsolid and then the bible says that the papacy received a deadly wound right which was which was caused by the preaching of the word that led to his deadly wound when it, when it exposed all his artifice and error and manipulism and wickedness, it resulted in the deadly wound of the papacy. But what does the Bible say? That the deadly wound would be healed. So what is going to cause the deadly wound of the papacy to, he, to, to be healed? Compromise again is what is going to cause it to rise up. Back. Compromise within the church. It caused its ascension the word of truth brought it down. Compromise will again bring it back. 